hi hi guys i am so happy because right now i can film <laughs> la journey part two meeting the producer filming under the stars and um, how i found the right team <laughs> so i'm gonna talk about this today just want to mention that there is this website that shows you all of the open mics in um, whatever area you are and I think it's an amazing tool to use if you are trying to get more exposure and sing everywhere it's amazing that's what I did in the first few months one time I was going to this open mic and I met this girl her name was Lila. We talked and we talked and and she was just the sweetest girl. And then when it was her time to go on stage and sing, I was shocked <laughs> because she was amazing. The way she was singing reminded me of Lizzie Grant, Lana Del Rey, but like the old Lana Del Rey, how she used to sing in open mics. I told her like, wow, you're amazing. and. Then she told me that she's gonna she's going to another open mic, so I went with her and I talked to these other people there and it's just awesome. <laughs> so how I found my producer. Hmm. First, of course, I search online. That's what you do. The the internet is your mm, treasure. <laughs> so I found some producers online and you know they share their their music and I contacted them. Then, while I was doing that, um, Layla, she had a show. I remember the day after the show finished and everything, we went outside and all of her friends were there. And they told me that, that they were going to a party and that I should go with them. And I was like, hmm, hmm. I, I wanted to go, but something was holding me. Like, I felt like, mm, like I need to go back in there. So I told Layla, I think I want to stay. I want to see the other musicians and maybe, you know, network. <laughs> and she was like, yeah, sure, sure, go ahead. I went back inside and I, I watched the shows and there was this band. They sound amazing. When my dreams were so when they finished performing i talked to them and then they told me that they have a show after maybe a few weeks so i went there and suddenly i was just talking to them after the show and um and they told me hey lena meet our producer and i was like oh producer i am looking for a producer hmm. so we talked took his email that was producer colin um i'm gonna share his website so if you want to check his music he's amazing oh my god <laughs> i was really impressed by how professional he was like he he made everything so simple i was so happy because it felt like like it's gonna work like this is gonna work this is a producer So while Colin was working on my songs, I still kept doing doing open mics. Work 
the mics and doing shows, getting to know more people. And that's how I met the filmmaker Alex, a filmmaker of Under the Stars. He attended one of my shows and then we started talking and he told me that he does a lot of filming and special effects and then I, I said like oh so you can film my music video and he was like yeah and I was like okay <laughs> it was just perfect like see what I noticed is that people that I found through my search online I couldn't work with them but the people that came into my life are the people that were right for creating this it shows you that sometimes you keep looking 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 you will never find it sometimes it has to come to you Same thing for the actor. Oh my god, the actor. I searched online and I found this guy. I met him, I talked to him because sometimes, you know, like you can look really nice, but how you feel around the person, you, you know, if you can act with them, work with them or not. And especially that my video is going to be a bit romantic. I wanted someone that I can feel a bit comfortable with at least. <laughs> And um, so I met this guy and I talked to him. I wasn't that very happy about it. Um, later, I met actress Zach, the one that you see in the video. And I, um, at first it was just, you know, like just getting to know each other. I didn't know that he was an actor and I wasn't thinking of him as should, that he should be in my music video or I didn't, I didn't think of that at all at first i didn't think of it until um me and and alex we decided on the day the filming the shooting day and i was about to ask the actor and then suddenly it felt wrong like i couldn't talk to him i couldn't ask him like i just didn't feel comfortable with that and so suddenly i remembered zach zach oh my god I should just ask Zach. He's an actor. So I called him and I told him, Hey Zach, uh, do you want to be in my video? <laughs> it's just us walking around Santa Monica eating ice cream. And he was like, okay, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Just send me the details. And I said, okay. Um, I talked to Alex and he said, okay, tomorrow. I'm gonna get ready and we're going to film. I didn't have an exact plan i didn't have a, a storyboard i wanted under the stars to be very natural to be spontaneous whenever i saw something that i liked i would just go there like when i saw these wings <laughs> oh my god i was like oh my god so pretty they would look really nice in the video so just everything was natural like when i saw the sunglasses zach was like should you wear one or something and I was like okay which one you can even <laughs> read my lips in the video I mean he gave me those heart-shaped sunglasses and good thing that it looked good on me <laughs> nothing was planned and I loved that about the video so when we were walking we saw this store and it had these pink with the bunny mask and I remember just being so hesitant like I wanted to I wanted to go and try them <laughs> I thought they would look really fun in the video and then Zach was like yeah let's go let's let's do it and I'm so glad I'm so I just feel so lucky that I had like Alex who knew exactly how to take the shots and you know they were just they were perfect and everything just went amazing. It, it was exactly how I wanted, even though I didn't know. <laughs> like, how can?
can you imagine something so perfect like this? I'm so happy. Every time I watch my video, my smile is like the biggest smile. <laughs> and even when I went through very bad times, I would watch the video and it makes me smile again. And it would just remind me that, oh, I did that and I can do it again. <laughs> like without Colin, the producer, without Alex, Zach, there wouldn't be a video. They helped make my dream come true and I'm very grateful to them. Okay, so what happened after that? I started working on the album. So I'm recording other songs. I'm the producer today. <laughs> no, no. And we worked, we worked on so many songs. I got sick at the end of my journey, at the end, like the last two weeks, I, and I still haven't finished my songs in the studio. I felt, I felt stressed and panicked. Recording while I'm sick, yep. The one to show you love is true no matter how. I am so tired. I was in the studio yesterday from 11.30 a.m. until 2 a.m. But it's gonna be all worth it and you guys are gonna love the songs. So the last few days I, I got better, thank God. And I was able to record my songs and then I went back home and that's it. I hope um, soon, hopefully, I will be able to visit LA again once I figure out, you know, all of my stuff. Yeah, that's it. <laughs>
Here I come, bright and bold, my hair's only in the crowd, just says hello.